Today's video says we're joining Nekpa, the North East Club for Pre-War Austins, once again, and this time we're at the Tymouth Priory in North Tyneside. You're currently looking at Tymouth Priory's gatehouse. It does look like an imposing piece of architecture. It's more like part of a castle than an entrance to a monastery. However, Tymouth Priory needed defences like this because it was so close to the Scottish border and the Scots would regularly invade Northumberland. This gatehouse was built following a Scots invasion in 1388. Walking up the grass bank at the side of the gatehouse, you can see it really is quite an imposing piece of architecture, but it does give you a wonderful view across Tymouth when you get to the top. In the late 18th century, the empty area you can see in front of you now was the hub of a busy military fort. There would have been barracks, governor's house, and over to the right, a tall lighthouse, two cottages for the keepers. When the Ministry of Defence left here in 1960, these buildings were demolished. In the late 11th century, Robert Mowbray, Earl of Northumberland, founded a stone church and monastery here and gave the monks a vast area of land. There were very few stone buildings in the area then, and most of the local inhabitants would never have seen anything like it before. After the monastery was closed in 1539, the church nave was used as a local parish church. The grander east end of the church was allowed to fall into ruin. Parish church remained here until the mid 17th century, which is why the town cemetery was laid out on the headland to the right. Right then, let's go and have a look at these cars. Come down the hill with us. Come on.
So I thought I'd try something different in this video. Uh, let us know what you think guys, uh, leave a comment below. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Here's a link to the previous video. If you haven't seen that one yet, I'll give you a chance to catch up on that one. Thanks so much for watching guys. See you soon for the next one. Bye for now.